So there's no denying that Battlefield is in a bit of a state at the moment. Battlefield 5 is probably the most troubled child that DICE have produced. There seems to have been error after error, bug after bug, and a lot of players are starting to move away from the franchise. Either that or moving back to playing some of the old games like Battlefield 3, which you can see in the background. And normally I would just think, well, you can write Battlefield 5 off and let's look forward to the next one. But the trend is shifting now and I think players are starting to get very frustrated with Battlefield 5 and Battlefield in general and starting to think about moving elsewhere. I think one of the areas where this can be particularly well seen is in the excitement that is surrounding the new Call of Duty game. Now when Battlefield was at its peak producing games like Bad Company 2, Battlefield 3 and to a point Battlefield 4 which again was very plagued on release but once fixed it's probably the most well-rounded Battlefield game. The thought of a lot of these players getting more excited about a Call of Duty game than a new Battlefield was a very strange one, but this seems to be becoming the reality now. I myself am a huge fan of the Battlefield franchise, but I am so much more excited for Call of Duty than anything that DICE could announce at the moment. And I think it's because the last few titles really haven't kept the player base. Battlefield 1 was just not really anything special I don't think, that died off pretty quickly, and Battlefield 5 has just been far too troubled to keep players there. I can't help thinking that this is almost like Battlefield's Medal of Honor Warfighter. So EA and DICE really need to respond and they need to respond well and they need to try and battle Activision for the title of the most hyped first person shooter because at the moment Call of Duty is getting that title. And here's the thing, I'm going to apply the way I'm thinking about it and assume that a lot of people are thinking the same. I am not going to be excited for any announcement that is a Battlefield game. So they need to do something different, they need to bring the player base back and one good way to do that is to revive something, is to get that nostalgia going. This is what Activision have done with Call of Duty. I think the days of remakes are numbered now, people have had that time, it was always going to be short lived but now the idea of bringing back something that players love in a new light. Can you imagine the hype of if we heard things like a new time splitters, a new siphon filter? those classic games and I think one game that really falls into that category is Medal of Honor. It was the definitive first person shooter in its prime. Most people who enjoyed first person shooters enjoyed Medal of Honor. It was the first time I ever really experienced an immersive World War II style combat and if you remember a while ago EA and DICE did relaunch Medal of Honor and make a Modern Warfare version and this was actually the game that pulled me away from the Call of Duty franchise. A Warfighter divided opinion, it was very polarizing and it sort of put the franchise to sleep but I think just something about it having a different title, the idea of it being a Medal of Honor game, I think that would get a lot of people excited, not just Battlefield fans but shooter fans in general because a lot of people loved Medal of Honor. And I think it would be wise to go back to a modern warfare type scenario because I think fans are going to be a little bit jaded with World War II after Battlefield 5. If they see announcement of another World War II game from DICE they're probably going to think oh it's just going to be the same as the last one. But something that is back to modern warfare, back to a classic franchise in Medal of Honor. I know Medal of Honor itself isn't much older than Battlefield, I think it's about three years older than it. But because it was released onto consoles, so many more players could access it than could access Battlefield at the time. And I think that could be a really smart way to change it up and try and get players back interested in EA DICE first person shooters because I think Battlefield is at a real risk of going into decline. In fact, it probably already is in decline and probably has been since the launch of Battlefield 4. As good a game as that probably is now, that for me represented the start of the decline. Everything after that has been very forgettable. Hardline was pretty fun didn't have a longevity, Battlefield 1 didn't really do anything for me and Battlefield 5 has just been a disaster. In fact if it wasn't for the Battle Royale style game mode I think it would be already dead. So EA, DICE, I think it's time to switch it up, do something different and I think a good way to do that is to bring back Medal of Honor, get that nostalgia stimulated because I for one would definitely be interested in a new Medal of Honor title. But that's just my opinion and as always I want to hear what you guys think down below. Do you think a change of direction would be good for EA DICE at the moment? If so, do you think Medal of Honor is a good shout or are there other things you would like to see revived? But in the meantime, you guys take care of yourselves, be sure to hit like, leave a comment and subscribe and I hope to see you all very soon.